Hello, thank you for watching this presentation on the Tempe ECE 4 plus 1 programs. My name is Lynn Pratt. I oversee graduate advising for ECE, and I'm currently the 4 plus 1 coordinator. The 4 plus 1 program is an accelerated bachelor's and master's program that allows you to graduate with the two degrees faster than you would be able to do so separately. You do that by sharing or reserving classes to reduce your total time to degree and cost. While it is called the 4 plus 1 program, you do not need to graduate with your master's degree in one year. As a Tempe-based student, you could apply to the EE, MSE, Computer Engineering, Electrical Engineering, or Robotics and Autonomous Systems Electrical Engineering program. If you want to change your campus to online for your graduate program, only the EE, MSE is offered online. Refer to the website for more information on each program and their differences. The EE MSE degree is a direct continuation of your EE BSE degree. You are required to complete 10 total classes, including your shared reserved credits, maintain a 3.0 GPA, and pass the written comprehensive exam based on your area of specialization. If you would like to do a thesis instead of the comprehensive exam, you would need to find a faculty member to oversee your thesis. The comprehensive exam guide is posted on the website and you need to take the classes that are listed on the guide for your area of specialization. Planning your courses for graduate programs can be very difficult since we do not have a major map, which you're probably familiar with for your undergraduate degree. Instead, you need to plan backwards. So in order to graduate, you need to pass the exam in your area of specialization. In order to pass the exam, you need to take classes that'll be on the exam. In order to pass those graduate level classes, you might need to take some prerequisite courses. Those prerequisite courses are most likely the 400 level courses in your undergraduate program that would be shared or reserved courses in the four plus one program. The computer engineering electrical engineering is a interdisciplinary program between electrical engineering and computer science. You need to take two required core courses, EEE 554 and CSE 551. You are required to complete 30 credits, including your shared and reserved courses, maintain a 3.0 GPA, and complete a portfolio or thesis. Robotics and Autonomous Systems Electrical Engineering Program is an interdisciplinary program between five of the schools within engineering. You need to take four required core courses, MAE 501, MAE 547, EEE 582, and either EEE 586, EEE 588, or EEE 686. You're required to complete 30 credits, including your shared and reserved courses, maintain a 3.0 GPA, and complete a portfolio or thesis. I keep mentioning shared and reserved, so let's go over what I mean by those terms. Shared courses are courses that count towards your BSc and MSc degree requirements. Reserved courses are courses that you would take while you're an undergraduate student, but they would not count towards your undergraduate degree and are reserved for future use in your master's degree. Many students only have shared courses since that is where the real benefit of the four plus one program is. It's important to note that you cannot share more than three classes between your BSc and MSc degree. Overall, you cannot exceed a total of 12 credits of shared and reserved coursework. For example, if you apply to the four plus one program and you only have two technical electives left to complete, you would share those courses and you could potentially reserve one or two courses for future use in the MSc program as long as you do not exceed a total of 12 credits. If you're interested in this program, students typically apply before they start senior design, since that is when many students start taking their 400 level classes, which are the shared classes in the four plus one program. If you have already started your senior year and have started taking your 400 level classes, reach out to the four plus one coordinator to discuss what your options are, since we want to be able to maximize your shared courses if possible. Additionally, you do need to meet the strict GPA requirements. Here are the GPA requirements for each of the programs. The EE, MSE, and RAS EE programs require that you have at least a 3.25 GPA. The CEN EE program requires that you have at least a 3.0 GPA. 
Let's take a look at some sample applications. This is a sample application for the power area. You will see on the left side of the screen, the student has listed out all of their technical electives and indicate which will be shared in the four plus one program. All of our 400 level classes are offered as 591. So students in the four plus one program would register for the 591 version of the course. You'll notice that we also ask students what their upper division math science engineering course will be. That is to ensure that you do not forget about this degree requirement and that you understand the undergraduate degree requirements. Looking at the application, there's a total of nine shared credit hours. That means that the student could have a reserved class as long as it is three credits and it fits into their schedule. On the right side of the page, you will see the 10 total classes needed for the MSE. The shared and reserved classes are listed, and then the remaining courses that the student would like to complete the MSE degree are listed as well. Here's another example of an application. The student has applied to the circuits area, which has four credit classes. The student has listed all of their technical electives, indicated which are shared, and because some of those classes are four credits each, they cannot have a reserved class. That is okay because sharing the classes between the BSc and MSc programs is where the real benefit of the four plus one program is. Since there is not a reserved course, that section of the application is left blank. On the right side, the student has copied over their three shared courses and then the remaining degree requirements to meet the MSc degree. If you're interested in this program, start filling out the paper application form that is on the website and send it to the four plus one coordinator to review. We might go back and forth a couple of times to review the degree requirements in your courses. Request to meet with the four plus one coordinator if you have specific questions and follow any additional instructions given to you. Applying to the four plus one program is very easy. All we need is the paper form to get started. Here are some frequently asked questions. If a student applies to the four plus one program and then wants to withdraw, that is okay. There is no penalty for withdrawing from the program. If a student is unsure exactly what classes to list on the application for the MSc degree requirements, that is okay. None of us are psychic and your plan will most likely change over time based on course availability. We have you fill out that portion of the application with all 10 classes to ensure you understand the graduate degree requirements. If you want to change your area of specialization or courses, that is okay too. You just need to speak with the four plus one coordinator so we can discuss the degree requirements and ensure that you are on the right path. Thank you for watching this presentation. A copy of this PowerPoint will be available on the website so you can access these links. Here are some important resources. We have recommended prerequisites for all of our graduate level classes, the tentative three-year plan for all of our classes, the EEMSE Comprehensive Exam Guide, and then the handbooks for each of our programs. The handbooks are extremely important and you do need to read through them. They list the degree requirements and what you need to do in order to graduate. Feel free to reach out via email to ecegrad at asu.edu to submit your four plus one application or schedule an appointment to discuss the program.